Hey guys, Brian delivers you the goods here. I'm returning to you for a track review, and this is for Sum 41's new track, Out for Blood. So I'm gonna discuss what I listened to and let you know my thoughts on this track. So let's dive into this review. Now I'm sorry for moving the camera around so much, I'm just trying to get it aligned mostly. But uh, this song. Derek's vocals in this uh, track are really good. Uh, I'm really excited to see how what their new album's gonna sound like mostly. And this is their first single in a long time. It's been like a couple of years now since they released 13 Voices, which came out in 2016 and now we got the new track out for blood and I think it's really good I think they did a very good job at making this track uh, the guitar riffs in it are great uh, Derek's vocals in this are fantastic he just doesn't disappoint with uh, bringing out his vo voice in this song. Uh, the drum work in it is going at a great pace and following along with the melody. But I wouldn't say there are any cringe moments. It There's like a punk rock feeling to it, which is really cool. And... Uh, like I said, I'm excited to see what they're going to offer for their next album if it comes out this year. I don't know if it will. If it doesn't, that's fine. But if it does, then I'm going to be really happy. Because <laughs> it's been a little while since Sum 41's put out any new material. Well, a couple of years, but... I thought they weren't going to release another song till like another two years from now. Because I thought they were going to take a five year break from doing music. But I'm pretty happy that they released this track. Uh, so good job on this song guys. You did a really good job. And uh, Derek's range and his vocals were going from one high to another high in the chorus. The chorus is just fantastic. I love the chorus in the song. And the fast-paced drum work in the chorus was really great. And there's not really much to talk about with this song other than the fact that it's really good. And it's an enjoyable a uh, roller coaster ride to listen to. So out of uh, five, I think I'm gonna give this track a good five out of five. It's really deserving to be uh, to get a great rating. And yeah, I'm surprised to see what they're gonna offer for their next album. I'm sorry if I'm moving the camera around too much. I'm just trying to make sure that I keep it aligned mostly but yeah definitely comment below let me know what you guys thought of the new out for blood track if you've heard it by some 41 and if you like this review comment below and let me know your thoughts on it tap a like on this video if you liked it subscribe to my channel if you can to support the channel I will be returning to you uh, Friday mostly for the Avengers Endgame movie review, uh, and the new album reviews, which are Schoolboy Q's new album, the Cranberries new album, which, uh, is surprisingly their last album, because their lead singer Dolores passed away, uh, last January. 
not this past January, but the last January. And, uh, Pink's new album review I'll be doing. Uh, New Year's Day's new album review. And Rob Thomas's new album review I'll be doing as well. But thank you for watching this review for the m most part if you liked it. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in my next video.